Hi, I'm Florian Kohler, and today we're gonna raise the bar a little bit on the Mass A shot. So, the first one was the Machine Gun Mass A, which is kind of like the standard shot you gotta, you know, learn in order to keep going. Uh, this one, much more difficult. So, setup, however, is very easy. All right, so for this shot, all you need is really three balls. So um, I like to put them in order. So like if you're playing nine ball kind of. So we're gonna do the one ball right here. So the only thing you gotta know about the one ball is that the one ball is not frozen to the rail, but just a touch away from it. It's just gonna help you to make the, the ball in the corner. Uh, the next thing I do is I usually grab two nine, or it could be three or four nine, whatever, just you know to make sure uh, it's like a nine ball game and I'm gonna do a couple balls just right there and the only thing you gotta do here is make sure they're kind of frozen to each other right so you don't want to gap in between the two and the nine which is the reason why I'm tapping the ball it's just because you know you don't want any gap so gently tap them on top of it just like that and usually you know it kind of uh, get the, the fiber of the felt a little bit lower and they kind of stay in this, this that spot there so all right, so we got the one ball, we got the combo two nine here. Again, for the combo two nine, you know, don't put the nine ball too far in case you don't hit it, and don't put it too close so you get a little more room to make the ball. Uh, cue ball, I like to put it right here, which is behind the second diamond line right there. Uh, same thing as the one ball, so it's not frozen, but it's not very far. It's just you know a touch away from the rail. All right, so you've probably all seen that shot. It's one of my favorite shots. Uh, I've seen that shot the first time on the billiard table, so this table is no pockets, and it's much easier on a billiard table. On a pool table, it could be a tricky one. So, you're gonna hit the cue ball, the cue ball's gonna go up, all the way up, into the one ball, the one ball drops, and the cue ball's gonna draw back here, into the two to make the nine ball. The whole thing is to have your cue ball slide all the way there, hit the one, and then the spin takes back, I mean, to hit the two and make the nine ball. So I like to do on this shot is because you need so much power, I like to put my knee on the table. So usually I put my left knee just like that and I kind of put it perpendicular to the rail. And uh, for the rest I'm going to do the same backhand. And the bridge I'm going to put it a close bridge right here on the, on the, on the leg. There you go. So I hit that one perfect, stay in the perfect line. You hit the two first, then made the nine. You know, obviously when you have a combo there, it's made so if you stay straight, you're still gonna make the ball. And if you go a little bit on the side, even if you hit this side of the two, you're still gonna make the nine ball. So that is pretty much the hard version of it. It's a very difficult shot, but absolutely gorgeous shot. And if you can make it, you're sure your friends are gonna love it. So now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna move these balls here. And I'm gonna do what I call uh, the easier version of it. So it's the exact same concept here. We're gonna do the two here, nine ball there, and we're gonna do a cue ball right here. So the other one sometimes you know, could be very difficult on an older class, older table. This one here, it's actually pretty simple and it'll be a good way for you to start. So same exact shot, you're gonna hit the cue ball into the two and you're gonna come back to make the nine ball. Same exact aiming. Same spin on the ball, just like that. There you go, so that was kind of like the baby version of it. Um, this one was actually not as good as the other one. I kind of went out of line, but because I had so much left spin, it still came back. So it's a really good shot for you to practice. And uh, you know, it's actually a real kind of game situation. Uh, you know, it's very possible that you have a very similar shot like this, you know, a little bit less distance, and you can just go and do the exact same shot. So, very useful trick shots, very nice looking trick shots, and if you have that mass mass AQ, beautiful shot for you to practice.